So this is gonna be a bit more of an informal kind of video. So around a year later, maybe about 40, 42 videos later, and about over 100 subscribers, amazing. So thanks so much for subscribing, especially if I don't know you, because okay, cool, I just spam majority of my friends. So you're like, yeah, here's my YouTube channel, you subscribe, haha. <laughs> um, but yeah, if, if you don't know me, or know me, just like, you, you barely know me, thank you. So this means that you subscribe from, you know, the goodness of your heart instead of me just forcing you to subscribe saying oh it's top G. I thought I wanted to make this like maybe I don't know I'm not sure if I'm gonna private it or if it's gonna be like you know what a um if I'm not gonna private it I don't know I feel like this is gonna be just a sit down kind of video reflecting on the journey so this is technically my first milestone maybe second if you count 10, 10 subscribers as the first about 100 subscribers which is which is quite big really 100 people um, I'm gonna try and get to a thousand subscribers at the end of second year of doing YouTube. So my approach was slightly changed and I feel like my ability to speak to a camera has improved. I think, slowly, slowly improving. And yeah, I kind of go from that, I go strength to strength. And yeah, so I made about 40 videos. I wanted to make 50, but again, didn't happen. What I'm gonna take from this, yeah, someone was just a bit messy really. Yeah, I just, I just wasted a lot of time in certain areas and just didn't feel like doing this at certain points and yeah but i learned a lot so we'll go from that take it further i'm gonna try and get to maybe yeah get to like 90 to 100 videos by the end of the second year again it's like one of those videos i want to look back in a year or a couple of years and just absolutely cringe because i think one of the uh, things I kind of like try and stick by is if I'm not embarrassed with who I was like a year ago I've literally I didn't grow I'm definitely gonna look back at this whether in happiness or just completely cringe uh, like, like I didn't I guess my first video but again just incredibly proud that I actually a uploaded my first video after probably I want to say five years of being afraid to do so which is just absolutely nuts if it might have been even more to be honest if I uploaded my first video when I was um, let's say 23 I originally probably thought about doing something like this maybe when I was like 15 16 maybe younger I don't think so I didn't really have enough brain cells back then uh, so yeah probably six seven years of just absolute not absolute fear but I, I thought about doing it during first year I managed to get a camera and I'd be like oh when I have a camera I'll finally start making YouTube videos I literally I sat down for just just a video uh, just my first video just talk about what I wanted to do and yeah, I kind of made it. I went to like the spare bedroom in our house and then put the camera down with my parents in our way so I, I cringe a bit less and just start talking. Unfortunately, I don't have the video. I deleted it because after finishing, I'm like, oh, this is really bad. I'm never gonna do this again. Yeah, I'm just, I, I don't like the attitude really. I really don't. Uh, Looking uh, back at it, I don't fully remember, fully grasp exactly how I felt about every video. But what I'm grateful that I did, I actually, uh, made a YouTube like uh, a journal entry for every couple of videos I did or every bit of praise or feedback I got how I was feeling about each video. The main thing is like the first bit, very big hurdle was my very first YouTube video. Here's, here's the entry, I'll read it out to you. Uh, let's see if I wanna keep it in or not. I finally uploaded my first YouTube video after years of being afraid to do so. Today is 11th of October, time is 8.39, just after my birthday weekend. I thought that I would feel something, maybe fear or relief, but there was a slight bit of anxiety in my chest, which I'm so used to by now. But apart from that, nothing, that's it. I felt a bit lighter, but I finally did it. But yeah, that was, that was literally no emotion. I, I didn't know what I was expecting, really thought I'd have more to say about how I'm feeling, but no, that's it. Yeah, maybe a sense of relief is how I felt. But yeah, I remember not feeling like much really. Today was going to be good, but when I got onto this task, I panicked and I procrastinated, watched a few random YouTube videos, but I finally uploaded my first video, and I'm incredibly proud of myself for going through this mirage of fear, many more vids to come. Nice. Yeah, this one concept which I wanna talk about later on, I'm gonna make a separate video about this, this kind of concept of mirage of fear, I'm not gonna give too much away, but yeah, just how ridiculous, like this, these more or less inner cities we build, all these magical scenarios of what's gonna happen if I do something, which is just a complete illusion, it's a complete mirage. When you actually 
put your hand through it, you realize there was nothing there but what your mind actually created. And yeah, I'm gonna make a video about this later on. I think that deserves like its whole like five, 10 minute YouTube video. So the second kind of like journal thing um, I was kind of documenting was just a bit of praise. It started like as anybody else. I knew that my videos were really bad. And yeah, I was putting about 10 hours worth of effort into every video from because firstly I had really bad editing software and secondly I didn't know what I was doing so I had to search up how to edit how to do loads of other stuff and yeah so when anybody actually gave me a bit of feedback saying like oh my god Yarek it is really good like yeah it really it really touched me you know when I made a week in life video which is my second video uh, Jack said to me like he actually thought the video was good obviously he, I don't think he really did but again just thank you mate just thank you so much for even just saying that the video was good. He yeah, says, this is what I said, mate, that video is actually sick, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark. But yeah, thank you. And then, yeah, that definitely like, not got to me, but yeah, I was like, oh, that is, that is nice. So, and this this is another one. There was last year about this time, I was doing this course called Part-Time YouTube Academy by Ali Abdul. And yeah, there's somebody I randomly come across called Michael. Um, I met him like one of the online like P2I events basically like um, but he was the first person who outside of my initial um, initial people I kind of told about and how the people I actually know who gave a bit of praise which you know what gave me like a little good a, a little tid definitely came down my eye uh, came down my face even I watched some of your videos yesterday you're a natural talent man just keep it up I see you have loads of potential and you're very likable in your videos. I'm like, it's just a very nice thing to say, especially like, we, firstly, we don't really know each other. And yeah, it's just it's just nice, you know? And this is um, another big one. This this definitely made me like, I don't, I don't know, like I wouldn't say emotional, but it made me very happy. I got very like, like I'd say a tear definitely came down my face. <laughs> God, here we go. Fuck's sake, this is so embarrassing. Basically, I have a friend of mine called uh, Tom. I knew him from secondary school. He does YouTube more or less just full time now and he's got business and a lot of stuff out of it. So I definitely look up to him a fair bit. Um, just in terms of his work ethic, the man he managed to achieve, I'm just very proud of like just the stuff he managed to do and incredibly happy for him. So like whenever he does say like, especially at this start, like mate, the videos were shit. Um, but he actually did say anything. Like I was just very just, I don't know, grateful about it again. And this was to do with like moving from Russia to England at 10 kind of thing. It's more or less a Q&A video. And yeah, so he says, already seen the first three minutes or so. Hook Jarek, this is great. Go, going to watch it in more detail on Sunday. Again, maybe it doesn't even mean that. Who cares? I felt good. End of story. Um, yeah. <laughs> this, this, is, this is literally like a fucking journal of every time I cried that year. Um, I wouldn't say cried. Like I'd say a stoic tear came running down my face. That's it, that, this is what we're going to call it, okay? I got a friend of mine, well, we're friends now, uh, who was my accountability buddy in the PTYA, uh, which is which is a really cool thing they did. I'm not sure if we do it now, but I got assigned like an accountability buddy. So we talk every week about problems and the going through, and he's just, he was just an absolute legend, man. We, st we still talk every now and then now, but yeah, it's just, he's achieved his progress so much now as well. So this is, this is really cool. Um, and again, just very grateful to have him in my like, just support network basically. He says, awesome dude, proud to be accountability buddy. You're going to be a legend, man. So confident and consistent with your schedule. Again, not like confident or consistent, but like, you know what, man, you're an absolute G. So yeah, that was that was quite nice. And it was there was a lot more, but um, yeah, it's just, especially just the first bit of praise you kind of get with this. It's especially for me, because that's something I really wanted to do is, is just, it meant a lot really, it definitely did mean a lot. Maybe, I think the whole thing is, because I didn't think the videos are good. The videos now definitely improve, but they're definitely not where we will be in a year's time, which is a good thing. Um, and yes, every time somebody gave me a bit of praise, like I got very grateful, I guess, very, not, I'm a bit, I guess a bit emotional, I gotta admit, a bit emotional. I am incredibly grateful for like all 117 of you at the time I'm recording this, who subscribe to my YouTube channel. Like, what are you doing? I don't know. Did I force you to subscribe? Possibly, quite likely, you know, but again, just very grateful that you're here for the journey. So if I do end up getting, I guess, not, for, I don't wanna be famous, but if I do end up getting some credibility in a micro niche, and yeah, it'd be just, it'd be, it'd be quite cool that you are there 
you know on the very first step is like before even learning to walk or just crawling on the ground kind of thing and you're a part of it you know so i'm incredibly appreciative of that